You are the newest, the brightest, and the most beautiful thing that has entered the Asia China in recent time. Igwe, <laughs> you did your homework very well, no? Igwe! Stop talking too much. Huh? Uh, uh, you have seen her. She's Ako. She's my new wife. Ako. These elders are members of my ruling council. Uh, they, they all have good reports. Uh, there's no flavor amongst them unless that one started yesterday. How are you today? Hako, you can go in. Thank you, Johanna. As you can see, each time I came out from the room, throat irritation begins. Uh, I, I wonder what the gods are waiting for before they take me. Uh, you will not talk like that. Don't talk like that. We still need you. Plenty. The worst is that Igwe has refused that we should go and get Abu. That strong missing man from Umunobi. No. Huh? Not me and Abu. As I told you before, Ago's family has some quarrel with us. Uh, and some elders amongst us uh, advised that we should stop taking Ago's medicine. You, you know why? Igwe. Are you suggesting now that Agu will poison you? Agu of all people. <laughs> A man who is usually surrounded by enemies mm. must be wise to, to guide his life with wisdom. Uh, you are correct, uh, Your Highness. You are uh, very correct, yes. Your Highness, Igwe, you are very correct. Absolutely correct, you are correct. But what next do we do about your treatment? Since Obuji's medicine has failed and failed completely, mm. and Dago has suddenly become a poison giver. What do we do, Igwe? Odiegu. Obuji of all strong men of herbs and roots. Hmm? Igwe. Igwe, what is it? Igwe is looking one direction. Hey, come, 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 come. Igwe, Igwe. Let us take him inside. Let Igwe rest. Igwe. Hold him. He's, he's, he's. Igwe, Igwe, please, Igwe, please, 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 The gods will never take it light with our enemies. When they wake up in the morning, they will see darkness without more light. Hmm. Iwe, you have gray hair all over your body. At this age now. I hope you're getting better. Mm, yes, I am. Fine. Aku, what do you think you're doing? Huh? Eh? Did we marry you into this palace for you to be picking gray hair every day? 
Please, I don't understand. What is the problem? What is the problem? What is the problem? Igwe, I am your first wife. I know. I have the right to, to, to make sure that she doesn't misbehave. So, is she misbehaving right now? Why can't you allow peace to reign in this palace? Igwe, if I pick your grey hair, will the sky fall? Eh? Since she's married into this, into this compound, it seems I have been forgotten. In fact, let me even come there. Igwe, did you see that? D did you see that? Isaac, <laughs> run away from here before, before your mouth starts bleeding. Igwe. Igwe. I said run away from here! Igwe. I said run, run, run away! Please, Igwe, allow her to continue. Your health does not call for this noise now, okay? Hey! So, I am now making noise in this palace, eh? Did you just say I'm a noise maker, eh? So, I have suddenly become a noise maker in this palace. Igwe, did you hear that? Did you teach her that? Is that what you taught her? Eh? Where is that woman? Come and explain what you mean. Isiako, we ought to protect Igwe now that is down and is not getting any better. Huh? And he has defied medications and medicine men. Hmm. No, you don't have to talk that way about our Igwe. Eh? You are the first wife. What we should be doing now is to look for alternatives. Alternative to what? For his treatment now. It's again. Huh? I don't know what interest you have in this matter. But anyway, my eyes are watching you. No, Isiako, what do you mean? You say interest. What interest do you think I have? Yes. Even in this matter? Yes, now, because even you know that we have brought so many medicine men who have been administering medication to, to the Igwe, yet he refuses to get well. Mm -hmm. The only one left now is Awu from Omonobi, mm -hmm. who also administers poison to his enemies. <laughs> do you want to also bring Agu to come and administer poison to Igwe. Mbawa! Start confessing now because I am ready to forgive you. Oh, but do you hear me? What did you say? Begin to confess. Repeat that thing you have just told me now. Moranya. Eh? Because me. <laughs> I will not stay and watch you do anything funny. Isiako. Hmm? Me? To give you Igwe poison? Your mother hey! said it all. Your mother it's said right. it. You think I don't know your plans? My plan? I know all your plans. Hey. Look, look, look at this little ant. Hey. You want to come and tell us which elephant is pregnant and which one is not? First of all, tell us how to recognize an elephant. Tell us that. Tell us what an elephant looks like. Hey! Alternative. Useless man. Oh. Now there's a little alternative. Come on, confess, oh! Because I'm Maya Kaz. Maya. Oh, give me. Nothing. You're not eating your food again. What is the problem? Is it Igwe's wife? I don't want to eat again. Nay, you are punishing me because of that bad woman. Eh? You are rejecting my food because of that mad Igwe's wife. Hey! I don't know what she meant by saying that I again. Oh no. Wants to invite Agu the medicine man to come and poison Igwe in the yes. palace. See? You. That I want to poison Igwe. Poison Igwe, you. Oh. Hey! Isi Aku said it to me in the palace today. Hey! hey. Oh, but I, I've warned you several times. I've warned you to take it easy with certain opinions when, when raised in the palace. But you won't listen to me. Look at it now. What do you mean by that? I said, what do you mean by that? Look at it now. 
Why did you go to her in the first place? Was it not enough when you people suggested it in the palace? Eh? Have you forgotten that I am the Onowu of this kingdom? Mm. I am the Onowu, second in command to the king, especially in administrative matters. You don't know? Now that the we Igwe is down, it is my place to make sure that nobody comes to use the gap to create confusion in the kingdom. And that includes that Igwe's first mad wife. What's that? Ishiako? Or is it more what do you call her? Nay, please eat your food. Forget about that useless woman. If she thinks her madness is above mine, let her block me on the way. Hey. Or even the less nonsense topic I, when, when she says me on the way. And I will give it to her. You know what I can do? I'll give her something home. Who do you can cool down? Huh? Who is she? Don't hit that up. That useless idiot, I mean, Pam. Hey, don't hit up yourself. Nay, just permit me. Permit hey. me to hey. deal with her. I could assure you, Kim. Nonsense. I come at I come at Don't heat up. Look, I will eat so that you don't heat up. Please eat your food. If she's smart, she's not been changed once. Let her try me. Yeah. I come to you, Please. Nice. I don't want to. I don't want you to heat up. Okay. Eh? Just wash your hand and eat your food. Oh, your don't worry. Forget about her. Igwe. Siako. Siako. What can I do for you? I have just come to tell you the likely result. What result? If what my body is telling me is true, then you should start getting ready to be a father. What? Siako. Is this a joke? Huh? Are you joking? When you get the midwife should be consulted immediately. I think I'm pregnant. <laughs> is, that cool? yeah. is this one of your tricks? Huh? How do you mean one of my tricks? When you were making me pregnant, did you do it by tricks? If not that they said you are sick, I would have said something very, very painful now. I, I don't know why you have this terrible mouth. Very bad mouth. Sort of saying congrats to me. Anyway, I, I, I just don't want to get angry now. Every single day of my life, I regret having married a Scorpion. A Scorpion. But, <laughs> you see, you see, you see, I could really pregnant. <laughs> Igwe told you that? Yes. Are you sure of what you heard? <coughs> but Igwe himself is not, is not sure at all. Why? I don't know. He should know if his wife is pregnant. <laughs> hey! Upe! Don't you know that Isiaku is full of tricks? What if she got the pregnancy from another man outside? For how many more years do you wish to wait before you accept the fact that the way you know cannot make a woman pregnant. Uh, Oga? Nine. Who invited you here? <laughs> Nobody invited me, but I was enjoying the story from inside. And if Isiako is indeed pregnant, that means all the stones in Agwechina must be pregnant. Hi. Don't talk like that now. You are a woman. And so what? If I'm a woman, don't women talk? Oga? Nine. Oga? And nine. Take four steps backwards and disappear from here now. Nah, I if you don't, I will take three. I will even take five. I said disappear from here. I will take five. I, will... I know. I know. I know. I know. You will get up. You will get up. Yeah, 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 yeah. 
Viens, viens. Do you know what you nearly did now? What I nearly did? Yes. I nearly did? Yes. Didn't you hear the rubbish she vomited here? Now, tomorrow morning, before you wake up, somebody will go to the palace and tell you that I said that the wife is a stone. What's have you here so cheerful? Huh? Mm, mm. But leave her. It's the way of women. Uh, they talk before they think. Mm, mm, mm. I want my wife to think before. Uh, oh. Come, let's go. Be a kaipo. Why are you people not responding to my queen? Is she against it? You're not responding to my queen. Queen? Which queen? Are you Igwe? If you are waiting for Igwe, you better change your mind because he, he, he can't come more. He's down. That's why I'm here standing in for him. You have no right whatsoever to address us. In the absence of the Igwe, Ichie Egent here is the Ono. Oh. He can hold brief for him on some matters. You lie! It is the Igwe's nest of kin that can hold brief for him. Ichie, when? When? As you can see, my pregnancy is growing. <laughs> it is now three months old. Very soon, it will be big enough for everybody to see. <laughs> is that what you want to tell us? As for you people who are saying that Igwe is not responsible, our gods will give you shame. Shame on all of them. Oh no. What are we doing here? If there is no meeting, I'm going. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, that's wait. Um, Isiako, please, when the Igwe wakes up, eh, tell him that I will later personally come and brief him on the matters between us and our neighborhood. Why are you people leaving now? I've not finished what I'm saying. Mm. If it's because of my pregnancy that all of you are throwing your faces up, that is your business. <laughs> when? <Where's> when? <laughs> uh, huh? You mean it? Yes, my. The midwife confirmed it. mouth of my enemies will be finally shot. Ishiako is pregnant and you are pregnant too. I think they say that I'm not a man. Please Igwe, don't tell her that I'm pregnant though. I just want to keep it to myself for now. Why? Why do you want it so? Eh, you know she can be desperate at times. And uh, if not for wisdom, I don't think I would have been able to live in this palace with her. Why is everybody keeping quiet? I was hearing voices when I was coming. And suddenly everybody went quiet. Huh? <coughs> Igwe, excuse me. <laughs> Where is this one going? <laughs> Igwe, when did we start having secret meetings in this palace? 
Ja? Hmm. Oh. Why did she have to go? Or is she jealous? She's jealous because I'm, I'm pregnant. Because the girls have decided to smile at me. Hmm? Is that why she's jealous? Igwe, you went and married her because I couldn't give you a child. And now, who amongst us is pregnant? Is it not me? <laughs> hey! Jealousy, jealousy. Oh, Pigwe, Alanga, so, Piaqua. Igwe, I'm sure you are regretting that mistake of going to marry her. Anyway. I actually came to ask after your health. I wanted to go to your hut. I now heard voices here. I diverted. And she's so jealous. <laughs> anyway, how are you today, Vika? Hmm. Well, when will you grow up? <laughs> when will you grow up? What do you mean by that? Aigwe. Hey, Biko, tell me how you slept. The weather now is too hot, Igwe. Especially for pregnant women. Hmm? Go and get um, black soap for me. Eh? Okay. Made from uh, Ujuku palm fiber. Oh. Don't forget palm or canal oil. Okay. And sponge too. Eh? Okay. Hurry. And you and you. Stop moping like a monkey. Come on, follow me. Now. Sorry, I was looking for Dark here. Hi. I, I hope all is well. You're too late. You're too late. <sighs> she has a set of two. <laughs> Thanks to the gods. Let me go. Oh, wait. <laughs> um, not yet. Um, no, no. Um, go and get Nchamu leaves for me. Nchamu. Uh, okay. My queen, I've sent her away as requested. What is it? You're not happy? Mine is of mixed feeling. How do you mean? When you're okay. Yes, my queen. My tea should have helped me to change the sex of one to a male. My joy would have been complete. Shh! Don't allow the ghost to hear you and get angry with you. Just listen to me. I have a set of twins. Quite all right. But one is a boy and the other a girl. Not two girls. That's what you be telling people. You have two girls. Why do you want me to go and tell them that you have a boy and a girl? Just help me keep this little secret. Hmm? I don't want people to hear otherwise. My queen, why are you doing this? Must you know everything? Eh? Can't you see that my mate is pregnant? What if she gives birth to a male child? Then her son will become the next Igwe, not mine. Can't you think? How long will you sustain this deceit? Eh? It sounds childish. Are you okay? I don't like this argument. I don't like it at all. I'm not arguing. Eh? It's not as if I'm arguing, it's just that. I don't understand this kind of request, my queen. Let me tell you something. Why did you bite my ear? That will show you how serious I am on this issue. And now listen. I have a set of twins. A boy and a girl. Not two girls. Do I have your ears now? Yes, my queen. I promise. 
promise. Then I'll reward you handsomely. Lala, how about my children? They are fine, Igwe. They are doing very well. Nejima. Nejima. You have to bring them. Let me see them and touch them. That's very thoughtful of you, Igwe. Man, you look so tired and weak. Yeah? Why don't you go and take a little rest? You just need to take a little rest. Let me also go and uh, breastfeed them. I'll bring them later. Okay. Mm -hmm. Do that. My husband. Thank you. You're welcome. You have to be strong for your children. Thank you. You sent for me. Yes. Yes. I don't want to remind you that a day after tomorrow is the circumcision day. And uh, again, we'll be here in the morning of that day for it. You go. Lala, come here. My husband. The lion of my heart. I thought about it. But if, for the fact that I do not want our son to be exposed to evil men. I'm not saying uh, Ichi against is evil. Well, you never can tell who is who. I have arranged for one you get to do it. Mm -hmm. But you didn't tell me. Huh? I was going to tell you, my husband, when I serve your dinner. Okay. If you say it's better, you see. But remember to use a piece of cloth to collect his blood uh, for one more to perform a ritual. Hmm? Hmm. Thank you, my husband. Okay. I will not forget that. Okay. Thank you. Why hmm. don't you sit down? No, I'll go back. Uh -huh. I'm just waiting for you. To... Okay. Thank you, ma'am. Okay. Thank you. Um, uh, what of uh, Igwe? He's there. Mm. Mm. He doesn't come outside anymore. Huh? Nay. This his sickness is getting to something else. Huh? Meaning what? That is why I said you should accompany me. Uh, what of Lola and the twin babies? Eh? They are in their mother's house. Ah. <clears throat> All right. Let's go and see. Let's go. I'm going to give you a little bit of a cookie. No, I want to give you a always indoors. You're asking me why the queen is always indoors. You are asking me. Why don't you go there and ask the queen how, yourself? I am sure you will like the reply you get. I can tell you, I mean, a lot of things have gone indoors in this palace. So I tell you, a lot of things have gone indoors in this palace. Igwe has gone indoors. Even his twin babies are always indoors. Ha. No. What else has gone indoors? I don't know if what I'm hearing is true. I heard the king has gone blind. What? He can't see anymore. Hey! Shh. Keep it to yourself for now, okay? Shh. Igwe! <coughs> Again, Igwe. Is that you? It is me, Igwe. What am I seeing? Hey. It is the Hamatan wind that is shaking the tree, shaping the leaves, drying the stems. <sighs> Agunechibe. Igwe. Of Agwechina. Igwe. 
Where are my eyes? Where are my eyes? <sighs> Igwe. Igwe, take it easy. It is not the end of life. It's true, Igwe, please. I have told him this before. Mm. Huh? Nobody likes the idea of the Igwe going blind. Mm -mm. But what can we do under the circumstance? Huh? Every day he sits here lamenting, saying one sorrowful thing or the other. Will that solve the problem? I want to know the Abiyan Kabikon. I've told my ancestors to take my life. I don't know what they are waiting for. What is the meaning of life without the eyes? Eh? Oh. <laughs> Gods! Come on, 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 Sorry, or before she goes into complication. Oh, when you came to my house and they told you that I, I was at Ekenta's house, why did you come there to fetch me? Hey, when I be when I be, let's go now. Hey, let I hope us you're go. not late. Oh. Uh, uh, Lolo is in labor. Oh? Gods of our land, I beg you, give Ako one girl, one. I thank you for giving me two, but let her hold me. One, one girl. If you do it for me, eh? I will slaughter goat for you. Hey, she has delivered. Shut up. Is that what you people are shouting? Eh? You want to wake up the prince and his and his sister? Just stop shouting, keep your mouth shut. Go in. Where's uh one yogi? Go back there. Would have believed that Aku will get a son before me. The ghost would have given me a son instead of daughters. Anyway, over my dead body will I let anybody know the truth? Oh, oh my dear. Hey. Thank you, my sister, for coming. <laughs> I can't go further, sorry. You know, babies. He will soon start crying. I can't go for that. I know. <laughs> I understand. Eh? I thank God for you. <laughs> Just go inside and look after my prince. Eh? Let me start going. Okay. May the gods be with you. Thank you. <laughs> bye bye. Hey, Miss Yako. When will you learn something? I should have known that the fool will not keep her promise after all I did for her. Try. Hmm. Where is it happening? Where did I hear the cry? This one sounds like the voice of a son. <laughs> so piercing. Hmm. So strong. So much like the strength of my father. Hey. 
Igwe. Igwe was looking for you inside to tell you that your second wife has brought forth a baby boy. Igwe. What happened? Igwe. Oh, give me. Help me, help me. Let's, let's, let's listen. Okay, okay, just keep on. This one he's doing like this. Is he dead? Shh. I don't think so. But what do we do? Just help me. Let's arrange him. Then I will call the elders. Okay. Go to the room, eh? Yeah. Go and bring salt for me. Okay. Firebolt of you. Come on. Get up. Get up. Come on. Come on. Come on. Uh -uh. This is alcohol. I have one little stuff. Stay with him. Oh, why are you bent on separating our children? Eh? No, 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 no. Gosh, we're not again. We're children. You call this thing, child? Let's go. <laughs> the children are more. Let me see you play, play with, with that thing again that calls himself a man. Ah, no. Oh, both of you come here. Come here! Come, come. Come and sit down again. Come and play with me. Just stop this panicking, huh? We are going straight inside. My prince, please. I don't want embarrassment. Ekenna! Both of you should come here now. Ekenna! Both of you come here. Mm. 
Mama, <laughs> this is why you are standing outside today. That is now how you greet your, your lolo. You don't even bother to go down on your knees. Oh, I'm not surprised. You even greeted me today. I can, I can see you're teaching her how to greet, right? But you're not doing a good job of it. And what were you people arguing about? Mama, that's our affair. Hey! Stop there. I'm not done with you yet. One more question. Why is it that this girl is always following you behind like, like, I don't even know how to describe it. Doesn't she have anything better to do in her mother's house? Oh, Gadi, get this thing out of my compound. Yes, my queen. I don't like it, oh. I don't like this thing you are doing, Mama. Oh, God, you hurry back, please. Yes, Can you go and get me that opaka that I left under the palm tree? Yes, Good. Turn, my friend. <laughs> I've not started with you yet. Are you surprised to see me? Where is your daughter, Ojeli? I don't know. She left since morning. <laughs> I can see all she does is move from one compound to another. No, no, I'm tired of shouting. I am not tired. In my own case, I will take action. I was actually on my way to Nkwanta's house when I decided to come and see you to tell you to warn your daughter. The lion has no business with the lizard in the jungle. Are you staring at me? <laughs> Don't forget to deliver my message. Oh, by the way, one your daughter. If she's holding my son with some kind of charm, she had better let go. This will be the last time I will warn you in peace. Ogadi? Yes, my queen. Thank you. Hey! What have I done? Hey! You will not kill me. You will not kill me. And let me tell you, any day they arrest you in the palace, I will not go there to cry. Do you hear me now? Eh? And don't you know that before you, sw you swallow a bowl of fufu, you will first of all size it up. Oh, Jelly, confess it all. The way she insulted you, that we are lizards and they are liars. Oh, Jelly, I'm going to move with me. We're not lizards, Mama. We're not lizards. 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 Oh, Julie, what is going on? Your mother came here and insulted my mother. She said, she said the lizard has no business with the lion in the jungle. Is that what <laughs> huh? My mother has been shouting on my head. <coughs> My mother must hear from me today. Enough of this nonsense. Enough. My prince, my prince, where are you going? I'm going to the palace. My prince, I'm, I'm going with you. No, wait for me. My prince, my prince. I said wait, I'm going to the palace, okay? My prince. My prince, wait, I'm going with you, my prince.
This is beautiful. Thank you. I wish my hair could be braided like this. My prince, you are not a girl. Hair braiding is for my princess. You want to understand. What is there to understand? Better cherish the great day when you become the equal of our great China land. Will that day ever come? My prince, it won't be too long. You sit on the throne. Again, he's just holding on for the well. He doesn't belong to the throne. Why? Why should he sit on the throne when he doesn't even have a real botox? <laughs> you and I know that my prince is the next Igwe. Pack those things and leave. I said, pack these things and leave. Okay. <sighs> Look, I'm sure you understand what I'm talking about, didn't you? I came in the morning. I wore all my clothes. Yes, hey, I yeah, didn't do serious? anything. Oh, it's a lie. It's a lie. <laughs> you don't even understand what we're talking about. Not that I didn't do anything. Mm -hmm. I just just said my car was in it. Oh, really? <laughs> anyway, welcome. Has he heard? Heard what? <laughs> Wadi is getting married, though. Huh? <laughs> Wadi? Yes, now. <laughs> Wadi, your people is getting married. Okay. And you, what are you waiting for? Anyways. What happened to that hunter that wanted to marry you? That hunter? The old man? Huh? Please, eh? My father refused me marrying that man. I'm precise. This man has four wives and oh. ten children. Ten good children, eh, Godi? Where will I start from? <laughs> Please, though. <coughs> Anyways, mm -hmm. <clears throat> I have someone else in mind. Who? Oh. <laughs> the prince of Agrechina, land of course. Hey. That one? Have you ever set your eyes on him with any other girl in this village? In fact, have you seen him with any other person in this village? Mm, no, I haven't. Mm -hmm. But you know Uluma is my friend, so and I'm sure she will help me. Okay, have you told her? I haven't, but definitely I would. I will tell her. Okay, let's go. Okay, also. Huh? Going to my room. Hi. Stay there now. You'll hear one day. Hey. There he is. Who? The prince. The prince of Agrechinak land. My princess, please help me win his love. <laughs> Could and walk. Let him do the wooing, okay? The wooing? Yes. The, the prince of Agrechinak woo me. My princess, you know that's not possible. <laughs> Beauty of our land. Marco, how are you? I'm fine, thank you, my prince. My princess, I have to get going. I'll okay, bye bye. What's wrong with her? Well, what will you do to a young maiden who could not look at the face of her lover? Lover. <laughs> Did not tell me you have a lover. Tell you what? There's nothing to tell. There's nothing between us. Of course there's nothing to tell because Wako the beautiful maiden is in love with the prince of our great in the land. What? Me? Yes. Mm. Mm. She's mad. No, 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 no. On the contrary, she is as sane as everybody here. Then go and tell her that she's chasing a wild goose. Well, I'm available here. You can have her. Who called you here? Busybody. Your Highness. Your Highness. Where did you find her? In her friend's place, Your Highness. Woman, 
You think you can run away forever? By the way, what were you running away from? Honestly, I don't have a hand in my daughter's running away with your son. Shut up, woman. You are a party to it. You are part of it. You've always known about this relationship. But I'll tell you something, woman. If anything happens to my son, <laughs> you will live to regret it. So where are they now? Igwe, honestly, I swear, I don't know. Igwe, there's nothing I've not done to stop this relationship. But oh, Jelly proves to be stubborn. Igwe, please, if there is anything you will do to stop this relationship, Igwe, I will be solidly behind you. Please. Are you saying you don't know their whereabouts? Then why were you running away from your house when you learned that I sent for you? Why? Igwe, I was afraid. I, 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 I don't want to be locked up. Let her go. What? Woman, stop there! Igwe, we did not arrest her just to let her go. She must produce my son. Let her go. Let her go. Come and sit down. Don't bother yourself. Don't bother yourself. I will send the warriors to search the bush, forest, and the others. And if I set my eyes on my son, hmm, he will regret to have a father like me. Should go back to Gweke. I'm afraid the day will come when your friend will get tired of us and ask us to leave. Stop! Let no such word come out of your mouth again. As for me, Ogweke is now history. Meaning what? We can go somewhere else and start up our own kingdom. How? Good. This is what we do. Let's gather some few people rejected by their villagers. Huh? The offenders and people like that. We can go somewhere, start up a community, and now we'll be there going. <laughs> My prince, such achievement is never done in a short while. It takes almost a whole lifespan. My prince, I miss my mother, and I'm sure you miss your parents and the palace too. Oh, Jelly. If you are planning to back off this relationship, just let me know. If you are planning to back off this relationship, let me know. I'm waiting. I don't quite understand. There is no place like home. <sighs> Obu, are you tired of my fiancé and I? No, 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 tell me. If you are tired of seeing us, just tell me so I can start making alternative plans. But I have not said that, have I? But that is what it implies. I'm only asking for, for just some few more days so I can build my own heart and start living my life. Huh? I started talking about me going back as for going back to Ugoke, I'm not going back. It's not an option. Huh? Look, Ekena, you are a prince, and the whole kingdom is waiting for you. Good. Let my father take care of that. Yes. Let him take care of that, since they think they can run my life the way they want. I'm tired of my father and his arrogance.
from the way you're looking at me, I won't be surprised to say you're learning this now. <laughs> Are you asking me if I want to become a hunter like you? No. You know that Ugweke people are very crafty. By me looking at me, <laughs> you can master what I'm doing. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it's not our fault. It's our own Atarachi. So, you're proud of Ugwek after all? I'm proud of Eken now, not Ugweke. I don't believe this. I saw Obiajulu eating with Tono Che in his mother's heart. Huh? Why didn't you call me? I looked for you, but you were not around. <laughs> this boy will kill himself one day. Huh? Obiajulu will kill himself one day. But then, why did Archie? choose to make me a girl instead of a boy. My daughter, our girls are wiser than us. She's right. If I had known, I would have made her the male instead of Obi Ajul. She has the heart of a man just like me. If not for one thing, I would swear you are a girl. Dikana, if not that you're my friend, I would have taken this for an insult. My prince, I'm, I'm only joking. I wasn't angry. I was just trying to... My prince. I'm not angry. I know you have a knife for my sister, but that does not mean you should be seeing her. <laughs> How did you know? You think I don't know? Let me see you near my sister. <laughs> my friends. <laughs> you, let me just catch you near my sister, you see. So you've lost your manners. By the time I'm through with you, the next time you see me, you will not only kneel down, you also prostrate. I'm sorry, my friend. Will you shut up? Amara, give him 12 strokes. Hadia! Ah, 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 ah. Next time you learn your lesson. Ah. Excuse me. What is it? Imagine this fool saw me without saying a word. Young man, get up and leave. <laughs> Thank you, my friends. <laughs> oh, Virgil, what is the meaning of this? He did not commit any offense. Besides, you're not the law of our great in land. Let us hear this. You wait and see. My prince, that was really harsh. The families will find ourselves. It's nothing but accident of birth. If you find yourself in a better position, don't use it against others. Let's go. Don't mind my sister. Like mother, like daughter. 
always slugging people. I thank the gods for today. Very tired. This sun is too hot. I'm sure by evening those entire trap will catch up something. I hope so. I'm sure. The sun is too hot. I need a swim. My prince, what is it? You know I'm not allowed to see anybody's nakedness. But why? I'm a prince. You're from this village. You should know better. Oh. I've never heard of this before. Thank the gods, you know. Towards evening. Mm. What is it, my prince? <laughs> Look at him. That's my prince. Of course, now. Uluma said he confessed he loved me. Oh, yeah? Yes. Okay, that's nice. <laughs> let's go, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Good day, my prince. Good day. No, I don't think so. I think he doesn't want anybody to disturb him. Who's disturbing him? Miko, let's go. My prince, what is the drama for? That girl won't let me be. Oh, ah. oh. <laughs> I thought as much. <laughs> but don't worry. If you want her, eh, just tell me. I'll take her now. I will woo her for you. <laughs> you were a wife for me. If I want her, I will woo her myself. All the same, thanks for your offer. I'm only trying to be a friend though. Mm -hmm. But you can't wear a wife for me. Why? <laughs> but don't forget, I am the prince of our great I'm the friend to the prince. Meaning? <laughs> He doesn't like me, and that's the truth. <laughs> but you like him, don't you? Yes, I do. But what's the use liking him when he doesn't even feel anything about me? Have patience, Marco. He's a prince and they're always like that at first. Rumors are everywhere that the prince of Agunechina land would marry me. Yet no one knows he doesn't even like to see me. Ulum. I won't come to the palace again. I won't. You will come. Don't worry, my mother knows how to talk to him. Marco, listen. What he's doing is exactly what I would have done if any man comes to ask for my hand in marriage. Mm -hmm. Yes, as a princess. You don't expect me to jump into any man's waiting arms just like that. It's all about royalty and pride. Royalty and pride? Yes. What kind of man is that that wouldn't want to see the face of any other woman except his mother and his sisters? I wonder. Relax. Are there no men like that? Men who behave like women? Yes. Oh. Are there no women who behave like men? Mm. Wako, forget what you're saying. Behind that shy face is a strong mind that is hardly shaking in days of difficulty. 
It's yours, I promise you. Just relax, okay? Okay. Smile for me, please. <laughs> I have to go home now. My mother awaits me. Wait now, he will soon come. Just stay a while, okay? No, maybe I would come back later. My okay. mom's at home. Okay, let me see you. Okay. I know, take care. Bye-bye. Tell me, Ulu, did you send my message across to your friend? Why do you ask? Because I saw her today and from the look on her face, I could swear you didn't tell her anything. Well, I told her that the prince of our great you know. He's in love with her. What? Yes. At least I'm helping you to do your duty. Now listen to me. If you think you can get up one morning and destroy everything that I have worked for so many years to achieve, then I will not take it easy with you. What do you think you are doing to yourself? No, you need to see how he was behaving today. Only the gods know why he hates Wako. I hate her, that's the truth. Just telling her I cannot be moved against my own wish. That's all. If you shout again, eh? if you shout again, I will break this your head for you. I've been grooming you all these years for you to become the next Igwe. And you're just dragging yourself to the mods. Is it fair? Shouting at me will make matters worse. No. Let us take it easy with you, please. Please. Was I shouting at you? My dear, I, I didn't know I was shouting at you. I, I'm, I'm so sorry if I shouted at you. If you marry Marco, you start behaving like a man and not a boy anymore. Then what happens to my own future? How do I live my life pretending to be a man for you to achieve your own aims? Whereas men would have married me, would go away and I become a boku. Have you thought about that? Please, my, 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 my daughter, eh, sorry, my son. So I understand. Eh? Do you want Onochue to become the next Igwe? And then we will become slaves to Akko's lineage forever. Very soon, his mother will start parading the whole village as Nenigwe. Then what happens to me? What will be my faith? Please, my, please, my son, help me. Help us, all of us. I'm doing this for all of us. No. At least he's not shouting again. He's calm now. Thank God. He's calm. This issue has come to an alarming rate. Each time we go to the shrine, the oracle will say, it is not yet time. When will the time be? That's my question. When oracle begins to behave like this, then there is something fishy they want to reveal or deal with. Mm. And uh, for many years now, our Igwe died. The oracle has refused that no other person should sit on that throne. You see, get the message. That the oracle says it is not time yeah. does not mean that nobody should sit on that throne. Mm -hmm. okay. You understand it now? Mm -hmm. How come? How come there is no time? It's not yet time every time. How long will it take? Be well left behind two grown up sons. Fully matured. One of them should be crowned the king. That's all. Yes, you're right. Uh, the first son of the king should be crowned the king. And that is my son, Ubiachulo. Ichi Agenti, am I making sense? Quite right, yes, quite right. <clears throat> but Ichiako, that is not the reason you should jump into 
elders meeting like that and disturb the whole process. Will you shut up? Mbawa. Me, shut up. No, open your mouth. Now, what is my interest in all this? You should tell us now. Tell us. Elders, was I not the one who arranged this meeting? I called this meeting for us to arrange for the coronation. Stop pretending! You are just delaying the coronation of my, my, my son so that you continue to preside over the meeting of the elders. Hey! But our gods will not let it continue. It's here again. Call off this meeting at once. I cannot sit here and watch this woman talk to you like this. Let us see how she's going to fix the coronation and crown her son all by herself. <laughs> Elders, this meeting is called off for now. Where are you people going? Who called off our meeting? Who stopped our meeting? Elders! Ah! I missed it. Did you shoot? Did you just shoot? Eh? Yes. You shot somebody. Huh? Huh? You shot somebody. I heard a loud shout. Me? No. How did it happen? How did it happen? Let's get out of here. Ah! Come now! Come now. Come now. Ah! Man. Man. Obu is a very good hunter. Whenever he goes into the forest, something comes back with him. You guys are mad. No, 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 no. Uh, OJ, OJ, wait, wait, wait. From your statement, I can really understand that you are underestimating your friend. Yes. Let me tell you, don't underestimate him. Ekena is a very good hunter. Obu, tell her. Oh. Tell herself. Ekena, a hunter. <laughs> <laughs> Except that today he would have come back with something very, very, very unusual. Something unusual? I don't understand. How do you mean unusual? <laughs> What do you mean? Uh, <laughs> anyway, it's nothing though. I mistakenly shot somebody today. Why aiming an animal? Tell Chimo. yes, add, add that. Yeah. Why aiming an animal? Shot. Uh -huh. You shot somebody. Yes. <laughs> Oh, wait, 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 wait. He didn't die, yo. He ran away. <laughs> Obu, <laughs> can you please tell me what happened? Ah. How do you mean he shot somebody? It's nothing to be worried about, okay? There's nothing to be worried about. I just told You're telling you me he shot somebody and you're saying... Yes. There's nothing to worry about. He ran away. <laughs> okay. But for the record, I, can. I, can, I don't think... He... <laughs> Nana, something tells me that Ojeli, your daughter, is safe. Don't cry again. The problem is that children of nowadays, they don't think about their parents before they take certain actions. Hi. Where on earth is my daughter now? I don't know. Hi. Ah. <laughs> See, people still talking that she's one confusing the prince. From all indication, Prince does not agree with his father at all. Both of them have this strength of stubbornness that is so strong. Ekena is somewhere with Ojele. One day, they will surely come back. One day? When will that one day be? Nena. Or do I take it that Ojele does not want to see me alive again? Nena. What do you mean? Stop talking like that. Nenna, what if we go to Amma and perform some sacrifices? <gasps> yes. Who knows? The gods may take pity and give them some reasons to start coming back home. Good point. No, no, no. I wonder why nobody thought of it before now. Nenna, what do you say? What do you want me to say? What do you want me to say? I am so confused. Stop you crying just... now. I'm eh? so confused. Crying with... I don't know what no. to say. You no, we'll just have to do it. What do you want me to say? You we'll just have to I do it. You we'll have to do it. Oh. My son, they are there right now discussing about it. Even Isiako is also there. 
I don't know why they allow her to attend elders' meeting. And they don't allow me. Am I not also a queen? Eh? Uh, it is not out of place. Uh, her son will be the next Igwe, and the issue of coronation is being discussed. So they can decide to call her in for maybe one or two questions. But I wonder why the Oracle has been delaying the coronation for years now. Obi Ajulo told me that his mother is of the opinion why the coronation is being delayed by Agenti. And he enjoys standing in for Igwe. I doubt it. There are certain decisions against cannot take, except an Igwe. It's not your time. The gods of our land. I wish Onoshe, my son, will be the king. Why? Imangota, you will not understand. Isiako has insulted me long enough because she knows that one day her son will become the king. Uh, it, 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 it is not an issue. If, if, if our son wants to be the Igwe, let him be the Igwe. Uh, me, I'm contented with who I am. And who are you? Uh, no. Oh, no, Give them more six strokes. Next time they will learn to give respect to she whom respect is due. I said, flag them! What what? What is happening here? Why are you flogging them? Will you drop that whip and stop being stupid? And what have they done? Uh, people should learn to ask questions before interrupting, not the other way around. Is that all? Uluma. Why are you like this? Why on earth are you so wicked? Were you the one who asked him to, to flog them mercilessly? Will you drop that whip before I lose my temper on you? I said get out! So you want to show the power of men, eh? Let them see me next time without saying a word. I will skin them alive. Nonsense. Like mother, like daughter. Now I'm too afraid to go back to your heart. Thank you. Is it not the truth? Certain truth I better whisper than said. Go. <laughs> what are the friends? I know you love him. Stop <laughs> pretending. Uncle loves my brother. But I don't know the kind of uncle that is troubling him. You have to talk to him more. Hmm. You have to talk to him. I will, I will. I promise. I promise. <laughs> talk to him. I will. Hey, my prince. You're welcome, the love of my life. But let's stop it. Get out from this palace this minute. I say out! <laughs> Obiachu, what do you think you just did? What kind of nonsense was that? Please go away. Just go away. Are you all right? What are you a man for if you're this shy? Did I beg you and to go and arrange a wife for me? Why can't people leave me alone for once? Please go away. Go back, Jimmy. Why are you breaking our hearts? Just why? The earlier you will wake up from this your dream, the better. Enough of this pressure. Who is dreaming? What dream? Obi Ajulu, come back here. Obi Ajulu. Obi Ajulu. Yes, they are friends. 
friend is making character of her and it's so not fair. <laughs> because now it's not obvious. What have I done to the prince? He doesn't like me or even love me at all. What kind of embarrassment is bigger than this? Tell me. Stop crying, okay? Stop crying. I will talk to him, okay? You, you better worry. do. You better do. I don't want her period. Do you know how many sitos she has turned down because of you? Did I ask her to turn down her sitos? My prince, I'm sorry to say this. I don't understand. All the natural things that attract men don't even attract you. I wonder. Keep wondering. My prince. My prince. hear any more nonsense about it. If it pleases you, go to wherever you wish. Do you understand? Enough of this nonsense! Ikena, Ogini, eh? Look, I've never seen you in this kind of mood before. Do you know I was hearing your voice from a distance? What happened? Tell him to take me out of this place. I'm tired! You women, you are nothing but bunch of fools. Just like you men are a bunch of ingrates. I left other men who wanted to get married to me just to follow you and your nonsense headache of love. Ekena, go and perish with your love. Okay. Can you hear her? It's okay, it's okay. No, 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 no. Can you hear this idiot? It's all right. I left my father's palace. It's all right. It's okay. Eh? Ekena. I don't Ekena. blame you. Come, 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 come. I don't blame you. It's okay. Come. 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 Let me stop. No, 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 no. Don't, 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 don't do that. Don't be a man. It's okay. Control your temper. Eh? Control your temper. It's okay. Please go. It's okay. I don't want to see you again. Go. It's okay. Just go. It's okay. Idiot. Where on earth could she have gone to? The question is how come nobody noticed when she left? And the phone door was intact when, when we got up. Ha! This is shocking. Obu, I remember she told me that she one of these days run away and go back to Ogweke. Now she has carried out her threats. That's not possible. Does she know her way? She doesn't. Wait. Wait. We have to go and start looking for her right now. We have to go and look for her right now. Because the forest between us and Amokwa is not safe. It's not healthy at all. There are lots of headhunters and ritual mothers. Hey! Let's go. Oh, boom. Eh? Let's go. Okay. What would I tell her mother now? I don't know. Let me get my... No, you get the... Let me get the last and...
Brother, um, please. Um, I think I missed my way. Um, please. I'm looking for the track road leading to work. My brother. May I know the track leading to work here? My brother, please, I'm looking for the track leading to Ubeke. Don't you wear? Ubeke, I think, I think I missed my way. Ah, please don't hurt me! Please don't hurt me! Please! Please don't hurt me! Please don't hurt me! Please! Please don't hurt me! Please! Please don't kill me! Please! 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 Please don't kill me! Please! Ah! What kind of... What is this? Oh, Jelly! Oh, Jelly! Take it easy. Look, you're not even using your knife. Eh? Obum. Ready? I'm tired. I'm very, very tired. I don't even know where to go from here. Huh? I know. Oh, Jelly! Oh, Jelly! May the gods protect us. I just hope she's not gone to the abode of pythons and other dangerous animals. God forbid. Look, let's not be pessimistic now. Okay. Okay? Huh? Oh, Jelly! Oh, Jelly! Oh, Jelly! Uh. Huh? Why are women this stubborn? Huh? Why are women this stubborn? How can she decide to go out knowing that she, 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 she doesn't know her way around here? You know, my father once told me about the one with thinking of a woman. Now I believe. Women are nothing but taller children with breasts on their chest and emptiness of their mind. Look, Hekena, please. Don't talk so bad about women, okay? There are still good women out there. Come on, let's back to Oh, Jelly! Oh, are we, Jelly! Are we taking that way? They have rejected her. Why? You got the wrong person. For reason, I don't know. The oracle has rejected her. Wise one. So what are you going to do now? Take her away and get me another person. Take her away. How can an oracle reject such a pretty girl? Don't be stupid. If you ask that kind of childish question again. You will catch leprosy now! Oh, yeah, leave! Something like what? Ah, are you not a man? If the Oracle jetted her, she would get her too. Now come on, Mara Heber. Can't you see this girl is fine? And I'm only feeling so happy. Is it more important than to go and live for another girl? Just tell me. Ha ha. Look at this one. Eh, if you're not ready to do, just watch my back. Watch my limbo. Watch my back. You have to. This one you have in Chankota in your hand. Guess where? Mm. Mm. 
the stream. I just want to go and freshen up. And you're going to the stream without your guards. Obi Ajulu, you forget you are a prince. And on such rare movements, you should always go with some guards. I just don't want to go with them. It's just not for me to just swim and then have a cold bath. Okay. Uh, in that case, I will go with you. Since the soap you have in your hands will be enough for both of us. No, please, I want to go alone. Why do you always refuse going to the stream with me? Are there no times in your life when you just decide to stay alone or, or do certain things on your own? Okay, in that case, go well. And may our ancestors be with you. And you go too. well. <laughs> Welcome. Welcome, my daughter. <laughs> my prince, I brought this for you. No, I'm coming. I want to remove it. Don't mind him. He'll come back to his senses one of his days, okay? Thank you, Nim. Thank you. <laughs> Let's see what you brought. Mm. Some more <laughs> I have to get going now. I'll come back tomorrow. It's okay. Thanks for coming, yeah? Okay, let me see. You. Have you finished running? No, I'm not a boy. I don't like what you do. Stop encouraging her. It's never going to work. Are you saying... What do you mean? Are you never going to get married? How, Ne? I am your mother. Don't worry about that. I know how to handle it when it comes. And you're <coughs> going too far. We're already too far. Ne, you've never considered my emotions and future. Never have you. I believe it. It's not going to work. <laughs> mm -hmm. Wait, wait, please. Oh, I'm yeah. tired. Where do we go from here? We cannot. Where in this forest have we not gone to? Hmm? <sighs> Look, from my experience of this bush, I think we are close to Hagwechina and Amokwa village. I think we have to retire for the day. Huh? Yes. If we retire like this, how do I sleep? You know I can't sleep. Look, I can now. You shouldn't be talking this way now. Okay? Look, the only thing that matters now is
Finally, the oracle has spoken. Huh? However, the sacrifice preceding the actual coronation must take place at the shrine. So the prince must be there physically. Hmm. Yes. Thank you very much, Ichi Agente. Thank you. Indeed, you are a worthy leader. Thank you. Everybody knows that. Yes. <laughs> Everybody knows that, but Everybody the people knows. are all over the place are saying that. Uh, I, I'm, I'm purposely delaying the coronation because I still want to continue standing in for the Igwe. Uh, uh, I don't have such an ambition. Uh, uh, don't mind them, Ichi. Uh? May the gods of our land seal the mouth of anybody saying that. You say? How did you not strive to save Igwe's life? Well? Yet he refused to take further treatment. Oh, well, mm. even that uh, Igwe's wife, what do you call her? Ishiako. Uh, Ishiako, yes. She said that I plan to bring her with the medicine man to come and poison Igwe in the palace. Have you heard that sort of thing? No, I'm not quite. There's nothing I've not heard in this uh, Awalando. There is nothing I haven't heard. Hmm. Ignore them. I will. They can talk whatever they like. Mm. By the time the first of Fala of the new Igwe is announced, they will definitely stop gossiping. They will stop gossiping. <laughs> <laughs> Give me <Give me. laughs> <laughs> That is what we said to us. Yes. So as it stands now, we should go and tell the members of the palace that coronation will take place in the next AK market day. That is it. We um, can tell them that. Yes. Good. Yes. Now, who do we send? There and possibly and surely not you. Yeah, send send it here again. Send it here again. <laughs> send it <laughs> <Send the room. laughs> You are you are, you will organize it now. Uh -huh. You organize the the the, the we will go for the errand. Have you ever had this kind of beats and calories on your head before? No, my queen. <laughs> now that you have them, what does it mean? It means you are getting set to become the next lord of Agwechina. Thank you, Nim. It's just that I don't understand why Obi Ajulu be behaves the way he does. He doesn't even give me the slightest opportunity to talk to him. How can you even say that? It's just that Obi Ajuli is a very shy person. He wouldn't even know what to tell you. Nendebu. <laughs> oh, my prince. How are you? I'm fine. Have you seen your wife? How does she look? Fine. Isn't she beautiful? She is. You. I haven't even touched her. Why won't you greet him? My prince, you're welcome. Nim, Obi Ajulu doesn't love me, and that's the truth. He doesn't. Didn't you see the smile on his face? Hmm? <laughs> he doesn't like me. <laughs> Before you bring down my neck. Now, what is it? You want to kill him? Yes. You only want to kill my yes. brother? I want to kill him. Let me kill him. Now I know that Obiajule is evil. I can prove it. You know what happened? 
talk to me. Do you want to kill him? Okay. So, it has come to you defending your Ejima, isn't it? It is now Ejima defense. No, I don't come to the instead of trying to kill my twin brother. Who said I want to kill him? Who said you kill him? No! I'm here to understand who my mother is, so. Oh, what does that mean? Oh, my Ajilu. You just hear Oh, my Ajilu, come back here. Oh, my Ajilu. Okay. I will deal with you. And I will show you that I am still your mother. Tell me, what is wrong? Where are you coming from? What on earth makes you sit by the roadside and cry? Is it Prince Obiajolo? Have you seen him today? I know it's him. For eight time you see him, you must cry. Welcome. Come on, talk to me. You go talk to me. It's okay, it's okay. Please, please, please. stop crying. What is it, my prince? I'm worried. About what? I'm a bit scared about tomorrow's event. You don't need to be scared, my prince, my future king. See, tomorrow's coronation marks the beginning of your greatness. Go and rest, my future king. You need your whole strength for tomorrow. The future king, my great son, it is going to be great tomorrow. <laughs> the drums will sound and everybody will declare my son. The items. Here, here. Look. Rejected him. You go with them. I hope everything is set for this occasion. Because very soon, the whole place will be filled with the elders and the crown king and all the villagers. Oh, here they come.
Greetings to all of you. <clears throat> it is unfortunate to announce that the gods have rejected Obi Ajulu, the prince. Therefore, this coronation ceremony has been postponed at least for now. Makagini. Why? I can see that you wicked elders have planned to announce that the gods have rejected my son. But this will not happen. It will not happen. It will never, 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 ever happen. It will never happen. You must be crowned the Igwe. Please talk to us. What happened at the shrine? Did they seal your mouth or what? Oh. Oh. She saw a ghost. My prince, please calm down. My princess, please take him inside. Later you will talk. What do they represent? This also belongs to you. For what? Same reason that you are the most popular and efficient one within and outside that Gwichina land. <laughs> Thank you very much, Isiako. But I want to know why you are giving me all these tubas of yam, the ivory tusk and cowricks. I have not performed any service for you recently. You will perform one today. Just go ahead and tell them that my son is the chosen one. That will settle the whole matter. Let me ask you, why did you even tell them that the ancestors rejected my son, Obi Ajulu? Why? I am speaking the mind of the gods and not mine. And as for what you are asking for, I, one more, cannot do it. Do you realize you are talking to the Queen Mother? Am I a lesser mortal than the Queen? <laughs> are we doing power tussle here? Just do me one simple favor and you will be greatly honored. <laughs> Believe me, when I say I will do a thing, I follow it up with action. <laughs> Carry your gift and go. No one can bribe me to speak against the wishes of the gods, not even you. Fool. That is why people like you will never be rich. Let me tell you, you must crown my son the king. He is the prince of the land. Our father's throne has been empty for a long time. Please, what did the ghost say? Is there any ritual we have to perform? You have spoken very well, my son. And that's why all of us are assembled here. From here, we are going to one more shrine to see him, the mouthpiece of the land. Our fathers, that would be very good. But can we go with you people? Why? Yes, why not? In fact, 
Let us go immediately. Elders of the Palax, you are welcome. Thank you. Wise one, mm -hmm. we have brought the two sons of Iwe as you requested. Please, what does the oracle say? It is time for the decision to be taken. Great ancestors, show us among these two who the king shall be. It is your doing and not my own doing. <laughs> Ancestors, thank you for the job for well done. Thank you. Thank you. Greetings to you, members of the Royal House. It is my pleasure to announce to all of you that the gods have chosen a new Igwe. Another person. Which other person? Is that your plan? <laughs> eh? You people planned and removed royalty from this household. Lolo, please, let's hear from them first. Let's hear from them. We are listening. <sighs> The person is from this very family. It is all not here. What? How come? Uh, uh! You don't even shout how come. You all planned it. You planned it. You all planned it. Hey, hey. It's not going to work. It will not work. It will not. I suspect conspiracy. I know it. Whoever subverts justice must be flogged by justice. Let it be so. Your mouth said it. Mama, I'm still hungry. Obi Ajolo, Obi Ajolo, are you dumb again today? Tell me what happened. Stay with me. I can't fix this. I really can't fix this. I don't understand this. How can the gods reject the prince of Agrichina land? It's unheard of. You heard what Isiako was saying. She feels cheated. But I don't know why and how it happened. The gods know better. Maybe they will reverse their judgment tomorrow and decide to give Obi Ajulu his rightful position. But do they make mistakes? Ha! Oh! This confusion is getting to a level I don't understand any longer. Oh, <laughs> Bimo! 
Oh, yeah, my mom. What is it? Why are you crying? What is wrong with her? Why is she crying? Did anybody beat her? Of course, nobody has the right to enter Igwe's palace to beat Igwe's wife. Aku, what is your problem? Why are you crying? <laughs> My son is missing. Your son? <laughs> he got up from bed last night to go and ease himself. I've seen him, I've not seen my son. I've not seen him, not yet. <laughs> and you didn't tell anybody? I'm afraid enemies must have captured him. <laughs> eh? Hey! Listen, ah. You didn't tell anybody. <laughs> so what is the meaning of this? When did things start invading Igwe's palace? When? Oh my god. <laughs> it must be kidnapped. <laughs> Where are these boys? Odo! Eja! Where were you people when thieves invaded this palace and kidnapped Onochi? Haven't you heard? Onochi has been kidnapped. Anyway, both of you, go and mobilize all the boys in the village. Search everywhere. Make sure you locate wherever he is. Yes, sir. 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 This thing happened since yesterday night. You didn't want to tell anybody. You just sat here and be shouting. I need your food, sir. What is it? Why is your face like hard timber? Ne, I saw wonders today. What did you see? So you could be this kind. I just saw you because Lana Chi's mother, and she's crying. What do you mean by that? I can't remember the last time I noticed such kindness in you. May your tongue fall from your mouth for saying that. I want to prove to the world that I'm, I'm wicked. Get 
Let's go. Yes. Let's go to where? Were you looking for him? Ah. Eh? We can't no. leave him like this. Come, let's go. Why did you untie him then? Look, there is nothing we've not seen. Okay? What if the, the, the headhunters are using him to capture people? Eh? Let what if they are using him to set traps? Let us go, please. At least we have done our part. Where do we? We should go back, eh? Now, Prince. Get 
Camille, Guinea Camille, Diojo. Guinea Camille, Guinea Camille, Diojo. Obu Guinea Camille, Anna Tumoka. Tuku Bini, Tobamo, Zobamo. Guinea Camille, Guinea Camille, Diojo. Gini kamele, gini kamele, ndi ojo. Obu gini kamele, haji achumu kamuo. Chukubi nigwe, sobamo, sobamo. Gini kamele, gini kamele, ndi ojo. Gini kamele, dini kamele. Ndiyojo, obi ajulu. Hey, God's of our land. Hmm. God's of our land. May your name be praised. He say, how come? I heard that they told you on a cheat up. How come you're down here? Who told you that? My mother was responsible for what happened to you. I have heard her discussing with the guards in the palace that carried you into the forest. Mm. The intention was for the wild animals to eat you up. But why would your mother do such a thing? Why would your mother want the wild beast to devour me? Jealousy. Hatred. Mm. Wickedness. But whether she likes it or not, you are the Igwe, and I will not see any evil thing coming to you without blocking it. But how did you come down? Well, two hunters saw me, and they helped me cut the rope. And they even gave me water. Oh. You see... I think you should stay here, because if you follow me to the palace, hmm. my mother might kill you. Can you stay? Ah, have you forgotten I'm a hunter? It's just the palace restriction that has been keeping me, stopping me. All I need is just a knife and I'll be fine. A knife? I have one already now. I brought it with the intention of cutting the rope. So you can have it. Thank you. Thank you. I have to go now before they start looking for me. Mm. May, our, may the gods of our land protect you. Guide you out of this bush. He say, hmm. Meanwhile, let me get you something to eat before I leave. Hmm? Thank you. Keep coming. Hmm? <laughs> I'm 
are you trying to make here? Can't you see that the gods are angry? Just a day after you people came to give us the verdict uh, from one more, the gods came down by themselves and took on a chair away to show that it was false verdict. Now tell me, does any one of you know where he is? So, what are you saying by implication? What do you mean, what am I saying? Have I been biting my lips here? <clears throat> what do you say? What do I say? Am I one of the gods? Yeah. If they decide to choose on Oche, and then kidnap him. It could be they have taken him somewhere to prepare him for the strong tax ahead. Which strong tax ahead? Eh? In fact, I am not going to raise this topic again. You old men can go ahead and turn the hand of justice. That's your business. Where are you coming from? Where do you even go every day that makes you come back very late in the evening? Yesterday you left. In the morning. Came back in the evening looking like a hunter. Look at you today again. You're just coming back. Looking like leftover food. No. I've been moving from one place to the other looking for my brother. Who is your brother? On a chain. The king of our great China land. Is anything wrong with your head? Eh? What kind of juju did they use on you that's making you behave like a sheep? Eh? I think it was that day they took you people to the bush inside the shrine for the coronation sacrifice. That's where they gave you the juju. But don't worry, that juju will soon leave you. No, is there food in this house? I'm hungry. Come on, soft rest. Come. Mama, I think I'm hungry. Soft rest now. <sighs> the whole village is in confusion. Don't want to give me. Look at yourself. As you finish it. <clears throat> Your mother is now an old shadow of herself. I think it's time for you to return to the palace. No king ever rules from the forest. No. I prefer to remain here. And stay alive. And to go back to the palace and become a dead king. You're right. It's okay. I'll be bringing information for you. But I pray you don't stay long. Forest is meant for animals, not human beings. You have a point there. <gasps> There's something I, I want to tell you. It's a secret that has not been let out since the day I was born. What is it? What I'm about to tell you now will blow your mind off. But you must find a place in your heart to forgive me. What is it that it's so hard for you to say? But you must forgive me first, please. Forgive you? But you've never wronged me before. The gods did not make mistakes when they rejected me and, and chose you. I, I, I am a woman and not a man. <laughs> mm. May God bless this day that you led me into your secret. 
You're not surprised or angry with me for deceiving everybody. My sister, I knew your identity long time ago. What? What did you say? Did you remember the day I wanted to follow you to the stream and you refused? Yes. Where are you off to? This one you have in Chankota in your hand. Guess where? Mm. To mm. the stream. I just want to go and freshen up. And you're going to the stream without your guards. Obi Ajulu, you forget you are a prince. And on such rare movements, you should always go with some guards. I just don't want to go with them. It's just not for me to just swim and then have a cold bath. Swim. Okay. Uh, in that case, I will go with you. Since the soap you have in your hands will be enough for both of us. No, please, I want to go alone. Why do you always refuse going to the stream with me? Are there no times in your life when you just decide to stay alone or, or do certain things on your own? Okay, in that case, go well. And may our ancestors be with you. And go well. I later followed you that day, but you did not know. I thought I was going to catch you with a girl in the river. But when you took off your clothes, what I saw was the biggest shock of my life. Since after that day, I've not come out of it. So, why didn't you oppose me? Why didn't you oppose when they wanted to coronate me? If the God accepts you, who am I to oppose you? I'd rather die with the secret. I didn't even tell my mother. I'm very sorry. It was my mother's making. I've been dressing like a boy since my childhood. And nobody knows I'm a girl, not even my twin sister. 
Hmm. Your mother. She is a planner indeed. You are the Igwe. Igwe. <laughs> should I bow or should I? <laughs> Which one? You are the greatest prince a great has ever had. Even as a girl. And you taught me everything. Including humility. And you are a true brother. Suspecting. Because as for me, I'm already suspecting Ochef and the chair again. Those two men are evil. Evil. I don't know whom to suspect. Oh, my chair. Why is my world crumbling at a time like this? <laughs> <laughs> I think the elders are planning to send some you to go and look for him. Let's believe they will find him. Uh -huh. I pray that they find him alive. God, I pray that they find him alive. Because of our land. The gods are not asleep. They have seen that my hands are clean. And whoever is behind this wicked act, oh, something worse than leprosy will befall him or her. <clears throat> and I must come out of this. Stop playing curses. <laughs> Let's keep praying to God to, that he comes back alive. <laughs> huh? You know, there are so many headhunters everywhere. Hey! Oh, no, mom. Oh! I hope those ghost shows are not for, for my son, Onoji. I hope those ghost shows are... Wait. Obi Ajolo. Obi Ajolo. Where is Obi Ajolo? Oluma. Ne, he went out since morning. And he has not come back? Yes, ne. He will come back and meet me in this house. We are talking about headhunters. We have not seen on a chair and he left this morning. Hey! Hey! <laughs> How do we explain this? Acha, I am very sure. I am very, very sure it was on that tree that we tied him. So, where has he gone to? I don't know.
Aja. It is possible that wild animals have eaten him up. Don't you think so? Or hunters killed him. In any case, he's no longer there. Uh, yes, that makes our job easier. But then we must go and tell her the truth. Eh? So, what are we going to tell the queen when we get to the palace? Wild animals have eaten him up. But, there's no drop of blood around there. What are you saying? Must you see drops of blood before you believe that animals have eaten him up? Or see his broken bones? We should be thanking the gods for saving us from this problem and the guilt of shedding the blood of the prince. Uh, although you have a point, but we started the process. Mm -mm. I did not. In fact, we did not. Lolo did. Have you forgotten? Yes. Lolo. Lolo started, started it. it. It's cool. I started it. You have heard everything. You don't need to doubt what I've been saying. What do we do next? Let me think. Now you go back to your duty post. Go and find something to keep yourselves busy. I said go and find something to keep yourselves busy. What are you starting? Move! What kind of meeting was going on here? And who gave you the authority to ask me that kind of question? What do you want? I'm the prince. I supervise the palace. Does that remove me from being the lolo? In fact, I'm even getting tired of trying to make you the king. No matter how... Oh, so you, every day you are getting worse by the day. No matter how long the night may seem, the morning will always show so that the children can tell the difference between the moon and the sun. What is the meaning of that? Stupid child. Stupid. Mama, what have you come to do? This one you are walking like a defeated soldier. Isiako, it is only the eyes of a child that fears a painted devil. The oracle says you must make an open confession before the palace here for things to start taking shape again. What is less confession are you talking about? Isiako, you know what I'm talking about. Stop pretending. You have two days. Two days, Isiaku, to make an open confession, or the oracle and ancestors of our land will banish you from Agwechina. Mama. Hmm. What confession are you talking about? One more. What kind of embarrassment is this this evening? Huh? Isiaku, if you think you are strong enough to challenge the gods, go ahead and let's see what happens in two days. And it will be on a K market day. I am happy that you are the one talking about Ogu. <laughs> Isiako. In two days, let's see if you have Ogu or not. Two days, Isiako. Useless, defeated soldier. What are you looking at me for? What are you standing there looking at me for? I can never thank you enough for your care. But let me ask you, when will you stop dressing like a man? 
and gather that courage and take off this dress. Do it for once and shame your mother. The time is coming now. She has to tomorrow to make an open confession. If she fails to do so, she'll be ostracized from Agrichina land. So said the oracle. Will she do it? You know she can be very stubborn. Mm. If she fails to do it, she will go on as well. I will make my own confession. So eat your food and let it burn before it gets cold. Will you talk now, or do I ask the gods to do what they planned against you initially? If I raise this OG and pin it into the ground, anything can happen. And one of those things can be madness, leprosy, or epilepsy, and yet, she will get banished. Whatever it is, please say it out. Please talk, no one will beat you here or kill you. Please. Kidnapped hey! No stories. You must not say anything to anyone. Yes, Your Highness. Nobody must see you. Yes, Your Highness. You may leave now. Everything was well done. But I don't understand why you asked us to go in search of him when his mother was crying. Are you that stupid, Dodo? Can't you use your senses? Eh? Couldn't you see that Lolo was only using it as a ploy to deceive on Ochi's mother? Ooh. Oh. Did you hear that? Mm. From tonight, you have to use your senses. Don't ever open your mouth to ask stupid questions again. I hope you kept him in a place where wild animals can easily get, get him. Yes, we did that. We tied him on, on the branch of a tree. And once he urinates there, buffalo or leopard will start tracing him through the smell of his urine. <laughs> he talked like an expert. Yes, Lolo. Even at Naripu, when he farts on top of the tree, the smell will attract some dangerous animals. Or maybe a witch flying home from an operation. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Lala. When will you ever be serious in your life? Here, go. Learn to keep your mouth shut. You people should go back to the bush and see if he's still alive. If you go there and discover he's still alive, kill him and bury him there. Your Highness, I don't think he can still be alive till today. You need there to see the way we tied him there. Very, very strong. It's either vipers have eaten him or a buffalo. Even hunger should have killed him by now. Just listen to me. Didn't you hear that some youths are organizing themselves to go and search for him? And I'm sure it's Ichi Agenti that's organizing it. But 
I wonder how we use thunder to strike and set his house on fire. Now go and do as I said. First. Yes, Your Highness. Are you sure he has been eaten up by wild animals? Your Highness, we saw blood everywhere and even some broken bones. Yes. Oh, really? Even the rope we used to tie him, we saw it. <laughs> That's very good. That's good. Now remember, on a chase gone, nobody knows how and why. Mm. That is the response you will give to those parrots out there, uh, Ochefu and Ichi Eganti. Eh? Now you go back to your duty post, go and find something to keep yourselves busy. I said, go and find your, something to keep yourselves busy. What are you starting? Move! What kind of meeting was going on here? And who gave you the authority to ask me that kind of question? What do you want? I'm the prince. I supervise the palace. Does that remove me from being the Lolo? In fact, I'm even getting tired of trying to make you the king. No matter how... Oh, so you, every day you are getting worse by the day. No matter how long the night may seem, the morning will always show so that the children can tell the difference between the moon and the sun. What is the meaning of that? Stupid child. Stupid. As I'm talking to you now, you would have been dead. Come on, uh, Isiako. What exactly happened to him? Have you killed him? I asked them to kill him. Hey! But <laughs> I think. Wild animals would have devoured him. Hey. Has she started the confession? She has not said it all. No. You see, you couldn't succeed in killing him. He's the rightful king and there's nothing anybody's wickedness can do about it. If you don't want to say the other one, I will say it now and shame you. I also killed Wanyoge, the midwife. Hey! To stop her. F to stop her from what? Why did you kill her? Say it now. Okay, I'm a girl and not a boy. Hey! My mother has been concealing my gender from childhood. When she had a set of twins, we were girls. But she decided to fake the sex of the other one so as to qualify her to become the next Igwe. That was why the oracle delayed for a very long time and yet rejected Obi Ajolo. The gods told me they would not crown a woman Igwe. Even though Isiaku here tried to bribe me. Thank you, Obiadulu, for your boldness. You're welcome. It pains me that things have taken such turns. As it is now, what do we do against the prince and his family? If you start war, who will support you? Who shall go with us against the king's family? Nobody. Mm -hmm. So my daughter is gone just like that. Nenna, please, take heart once and for all. So, I will remain childless. The rest of my life, do I have any other child apart from Ojeli? 
Eh? Try and understand us. We are your friends, Nenna. Eh? We're your friends. <laughs> You see, it is unfortunate that things went that way. Please accept the apologies and condolences of the royal family. What happened to your daughter in the course of her relationship with my son is still a mystery to me. You have refused to be consoled, and my son has also refused to be consoled. I don't know how to plead with you to forgive and forget. Huh? Please. And take heart. Oh, ah, Ekena, you are here. Please come and sit down. I invited Ojeli's mother to plead with her to forgive and forget for all that have happened. Igwe, I went to her house yesterday and uh, she walked me out. Mama. Please, please find a place in your heart and accept my condolences. It pains me. It pains me that the woman the woman I did, the woman I loved, it pains me that the woman I loved. <laughs> what is that again, again, now? Eh? <laughs> what, what is that? People <laughs> should take heart. She just showed, she just showed herself once to me. The next day she's gone. Mm. Mm. Okay.